What's happening, everybody? I'm Grimmaster. Welcome to Factoroids, a kind of automation game where you basically go to asteroids and mine them out. Uh, I've had this for a minute. I just haven't had the time to actually get to it. So I figured we would... Introduction. I mean, what? What? Quick introduction. All right. I figured we give it a shot. Let me know if you guys want to see more. Hit the like button. Leave comments. Uh, subscribe if you're new and you haven't. That way you don't miss videos that I do in the future. Okay, what? This is interesting. This is designed to teach you the basics of factoroids. Skip this introduction to the campaign section. Yeah, well, I have no clue. Finally arrived at the asteroids, taken selection, selected the myriad of other asteroids in the system. Okay. Rotate the camera. Really? This is what you want me to do? I've done it. I've rotated the camera. Zoom in and out. All right. You would need to tilt things. Oh, I mean, I could just do this. This seems easier. There you go. I've done it. Hold down middle mouse to move the mouse. Okay. Oh, oh, that's okay. That's a different type of movement. Okay, it's made of blocks of different materials. Look around the asteroid. Find the selected spot. It's green. All right, I've done it. Okay, click on it and, and open the. All right. Well, I've done whatever. Okay, so land or mothership. So this is the main thing that starts it all. Put you down here. Okay, I dig the animation. Ooh, little robot dude. All right. Uh, finally, your ship has landed on the surface of the celestial body, but there's a little time for celebration. Automation construction bot is already deployed. In the bot. Oh, I didn't know I could. All right. Got a whole bunch of things. Oh, so this is like... This is not exactly what I expected. I thought it was just going to be like, like, uh, setting stuff up and everything. I didn't realize that the robot would be doing stuff. Uh, put, see the ice field on the edge of the plateau? Send them there. Am I right? Okay, there's already stuff here. Alright, go over there. Oh no, you mean over here. Well, there's stuff right here, though. What's all this about? Like a whole system already here. Alright. Uh, give it a dig command to simply dig ice. How do I dig command? Oh, right there. <laughs> Alright. Man and mine on the other side of the asteroid. Go ahead and find it. Move your camera around. Okay, well, yeah, yeah, yeah. I saw that. That's what I was saying. There's like a thing already over here. Okay, so I'm supposed to tell you to come over here. Oh, I need to select it. Luckily for us, there's a pile of iron ore left in the storage belt. Storage next to the mine and conveyor. Okay. The belts in the line are not oriented correctly. Alright. Uh, you can repeatedly click on each belt in the line to change its direction. Alright. Ah. Camera angle. What do you want me to do? Okay. Look at the iron mine. You can see that it's not working because there's no power. So we need to build solar power. The main purpose of bots is construction. I mean, I told the little bot to come over here. He's coming over here, right? <clears throat> you did not come over here. Like I told you to. Alright. Solar panel. I guess I'm supposed to... Oh, wait, no, where do you want me to put this? Oh, over here, because this is where the sunlight is. That would make more sense. Did I change all these, by the way? No, there's actually something that's just straight up... What the frick is happening here? I don't know. I guess we're supposed to move that later on. What are you doing? Oh, this is super weird because of the angles of the thing. I like it, though. Um, I'm, this is one of the reasons why I, I requested a key to this. Because this game looked like it'd be pretty entertaining, and I think it does look pretty entertaining. Okay. Look along the conveyor, the belt line, coming to the iron mine, you'll see that there's interruption in one place. Build a conveyor belt to choose the... close the gap? Okay. Oh, wait, I need a little robot, man. There... Okay, it was like, is there a way to, like, do... Okay, so we put this right here. Hold shift key? Why? Oh, apparently I can just 
build it? Or is the little robot building it? Oh no, he's coming down. What's happening? It looks strange. Go. Okay. Deliver power to the mine. You need to build this uh, panel, a power line connecting the solar panel to the nearest storage. Will be enough. The conveyor belt will conduct the electricity all the way to the mine. All buildings are part of the power grid. Okay. Some buildings like power lines, conveyor belts, pipes can be built in lines. You can do this by dragging a line on the ground. Am I supposed to... you? Power line. Okay, and there we go. Like a little cable that comes off here now. My little robot's just gotta come over and build stuff. Alright, I dig it. I'm gonna watch video. I don't need to watch the video. I have to figure it out. We got a menu, we got objectives, we got projects, bot path, seismogram. Power grid. Okay, and there is a fast mode. That's what I was wondering. Alright. You have more than one bot for faster construction to get new bot, build a bot dock. Okay, so you're gonna build me a bot dock. That's just simply how we get more stuff. Alright, build the bot dock next to the mothership. Your bot will not be uh, not have to travel far with construction material. Yeah, yeah, it's really just like, right there. Wait, am I, am I gonna have to connect it to power two though? Oh, that's weird. Okay. Are you sending stuff up here now? Oh yeah, it's digging it up now. You're like a limited amount of iron. Oh yeah, right here. Amount 99999. <laughs> What's this? Lava. Amount of 100. Alright, that's an interesting thing. <clears throat> Wait, it automatically produced one? Okay. Draw a rectangle around the selected bots. I've done it. If you want to expand the facility, you have to prepare it and build more solar panels. To make more solar panels. Oh, well, yeah, okay, that's not a problem. Okay, uh, you? Okay, I should connect it all up. We're gonna do. So, wait, are both of you working then? Yeah, they are. Go fast. So it looks like the power just keeps moving. Alright, building the last one right now. There you go. Okay, let's build another mine, this time for mining rock. There's an abundance of it on... Oh yeah, that makes sense. It's literally... Okay, so it actually tells me. Oh, so what happens if you dig it all out? Is it just going to be like this and disappear? Right, anyways, give me a U2, give me a mine. Hey, with the R key. The belt's coming out over here. Am I gonna connect it up to the storage thing? Or is this, uh, am I gonna need a different storage? I'm intrigued by this. This is why I wanna do campaign though, because I figured this would actually like, teach us, because all these automation games are slightly different. Like the big one with this, I feel, is honestly the fact that there's little robots that do stuff for it. Uh, wait, where's the other robot? Oh, they're both there. It's just the way that I was looking at it, it looked like one. All right. Things are getting along pretty well. You're producing iron, ore, and rock, but what's next? Process those materials in a smelter to make, make raw materials and smelt them into refined material. Build a smelter next to them. All right, you two. The mine smelter, conveyor belt, conveyor belt crossing, storage, bot dog, solar panel, power line, accumulator, landfill. Oh, that's what that thing is. It's only the first type of resource delivery. Get destroyed, creates a new one full. Interesting. Freezer. Use ice to cool down lava faster. Wait, why, why would I want... Okay. Oh, lava reveals valuable resources after cooling down. So there's a point to it. Let's charge. All right, anyways, let's build our smelter right here. Gotta rotate you. Wait, am I only building one? 
Don't, shouldn't I use one for the iron? What am I... Why am I doing this? What do you make? Uh, silicone rock. It's creating carbon. Okay. Sure. I need to have it go somewhere, right? Okay, I mean, I did what you want. Can I move this? Oh, I can, good. Can I shrink it? No. Okay. I can minimize it too. Oh, that's nice. You know what? I like that more than what you're showing me. It's a lot less to like slap up on the screen. And it's do it does the same thing. Okay, so now we need to build a storage, which makes sense. Again, am I selecting both of them? They're like, it's because they're on top of each other. That's what's confusing the crap out of me. Slap you up there. Sunlight's 71%. So is the sunlight not actually moving? It doesn't seem like it. I mean, if it's an asteroid, it would kind of make sense. All right. And now build another smelter over here. Okay, so I knew I was thinking, like, do I need a smelter for this? I do. So you do this. Give me a different thing I can form here. Making carbon. Right? Select this. So you're making me up one iron. But what does it take it now? Iron ore. Okay. Alright, build another smelter. I've done that. Factories. Factories are the main production buildings. You can build iron, carbon, and steel in a factory. Alright, let's do this. Little robot dudes. Little robot dudes. Give me a factory. And again, I'm gonna need to build a conveyor belt here too, I'm assuming. Not telling me yet, so it won't let me do it, I don't think. Alright. And then same thing, select recipe, destroy all materials, demolish, on off, okay. Uh, steel production. I've done it. Okay, build the factory in the green mark, build the iron, yeah, 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 yeah. So I need conveyor belt right here. Now you let me do it, it won't let me do it. All right. Then my guess is we gotta take it into the ship. Take a minute to actually produce it. It's three? Do I not have three? I feel like there's multiples here. Okay. Inside, one with the iron, other with carbon, and belt heading outside with steel. Oh, okay, so I see it, I see it, I see it. I was like, I feel like I'm missing a stage, and I am. It's right here. here. All right, you take the steel this way and you throw it inside of here. We have iron, we have iron ore, we have ice, and we have rock. So are you gonna start going? Why is the carbon not being dropped off? Why are you not going in here? Oh, okay, I'm like, I'm like, I don't understand what you're telling me to do here. For some reason, it's actually keep, it was keeping some just as reserves. That's kind of cool. I, I kind of wish a lot of games actually had that with the automation stuff. All right? Dyson Spear. That is the game this kind of reminds me of a little bit, but to a slightly different degree. All right, we just need to put five of those in the mothership. I dig this. Like, I love automation games. I've done a lot of them on the channel. Uh, it's, it's just games that I've always enjoyed. So uh, this is, yeah, I, I like this a lot. This, this whole concept of being on an asteroid and doing all the automation is just, it's a cool concept. I mean, it's definitely gonna be, that means you're gonna be setting up multiple factories and stuff. There is uh, other modes, but I figured going through this would be the best thing. Export, all right. Congratulations, complete the factory's introduction. You play the rest of the campaigns. You can dive deeper into the game mechanics. Alright, finish the mission. Yes, start another campaign. Okay, so we have Asteroid Belt. 
Tutorials, foothold, what? Okay, I don't care about any of that. Foothold. What? So there's like, what, what, what? Where's this foothold you speak? Inferno. Pressure cooker. Okay, so it's like way off here. Well, let's try the asteroid belt. <laughs> Alright. You select it in Java. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, yeah, see, it didn't even say in the tutorial you can click up here, but. Asteroid belt is a torus shaped region between the orbits of planets Mars and Jupiter. Contains many bodies of all sizes and shapes, from tiny dust particles to a dwarf planet, Ceres. It provides a perfect opportunity for extraterrestrial mining oper op operations. Some asteroids contain very valuable resources. Nearly non-existent gravity makes construction and material transport relatively easy. Distance from Earth is, of course, a challenge, but nothing you can't handle. Okay, choose the location for your mothership. It will bring the initial resources down. Don't rely on it too much. Okay. Let's see here. What are we looking at right now? I mean, we got some copper over here. Stone I can get everywhere. Uh, is that the only copper deposit on this entire asteroid? I think so. Looks like it. All right, well, we got this nice flat surface right here. Kind of slap you up kind of, I think, right here on the edge. All right. Build a basic mining colony. Make sure you start production rock, ice, carbon. What? Producing rock, ice, carbon, iron, and silicone. Where's the silicone? Okay. You don't mistake iron for iron ore, silicone for silicone ore. What do you mean? What is this? This is iron ore. Yes. What the frick does silicone ore look like? Oh, I bet it's this right here, isn't it? Yeah, alright. Okay, so I guess first things first. I do have some resources. What am I? Oh, I don't have a lot of resources. What does the mine take to build? Two rock and one ice. Okay, so it's not like super expensive. Let's put it right. How much is here? Thousand, five thousand, five thousand. Think I'll start right here. So a little robot. Give me a mine. Slap you up right here. Rotate so you're going that way. Slap up a mine right here. Slap up a mine right here. Then we have ice as well. Let's slap up a mine right there. Okay, so you can go run around and do all that nonsense. Then at the same time, I rod brings storage full of resources from ore. Interesting. Okay, storage. Do I want a storage in each one of these? I guess maybe. Slap you up here. Wait, what does the storage take to build? Two, two, two. I mean, we have enough to add a storage to each one. Slap up a storage here, because this way, while I'm waiting, they're at least. Oh, they're not going to be producing anything. Oh. Just hit me. We don't have any power. Bot is already quite busy. That's fine. I don't care. I can be super busy. It's totally okay with me. All right, set all that stuff up. Mmm, I lied. Set all this stuff up right here. But we're gonna cancel this. Okay, I think this will connect all the power up. <clears throat> and we should be fine. I have a lot of work for you to do, so we're just gonna go fast right now. So you can you can just go crazy building all this stuff up. Power shortage at mine. I understand. What I expected. None of these things have any sort of power to them. And you're building the last mine over there. Power shortage at that mine, which is perfectly fine. Wait, are you only bringing one thing at a time? Oh lord. So even on fast mode, you're giving you a lot to do. I think maybe the the best thing would have actually been build another bot. Bit, uh, give me you for a second. Bot dog. Okay, 
Okay, and you're coming over here to- I'm gonna just cancel this storage for right now. You've already done the rock, you've already done the iron, and we're doing the silicone right now. My voice keeps going out, it's driving me nuts. Right, I got my daughter's cold. Right, got two more things to bring over. Yeah, I go so far for it. I almost feel like I'm gonna cancel this, this, this. Okay, is there a hotkey for it? I don't know. Delete. Nope, none of those. All right, so what are you doing right now? Doing a little bot? You should build all these. I'm pretty sure because they're right next to each other, they should be powered and it should be fine. And then at some point I also, like after I'm done with all this, I think I cancel this for right now too, God. Two and two, two rock and two ice. They're still sitting pretty good. The iron is the one thing we're starting to run out of. How about you? 15 rock? Oh, nah, we're gonna be fine. And what about the bears? What do those take? You know what? I'll just click on you right here. Also takes one rock? Well, that could be a problem then. What about you? It's one eyes for power lines. Uh, this should be fine. And okay, now you're just connecting this thing up, and it's just gonna take a hundred. It's gotta move so many of them. This is why I want this thing. I put it there only because that way I'd make sure I actually get the power for it. You're not connected up at all. I decided to connect it. Oh, I see why it's not doing it. I actually need you to do one slight adjustment. This right here. Okay. No, how do I? How do I just can't? Oh, whatever. At this point, just have it build. We need more robots. One robot is not enough to get all the stuff I need done. So yeah. Let's minimize you, because I really don't want to see this thing right. This thing down at the bottom right, that's fine. Power shortages to four different things, which will be done after this thing finally finishes the bot. Then we'll have two bots to go and do all the stuff I need. Because, I mean, now we still have to do all the conveyors and move everything around. As far as the factory goes... Look at a power line accumulator freezer. We're gonna need smelters. I'm gonna need power to that first. Oh, you already did it? Okay, so this one's good. This one's all set up. We got two robots. So like both of you, you guys come over here. Uh, I'm gonna need to build some more stuff. I don't, I don't know if I wanna do power lines or what. Kinda think I'm gonna do Power lines, just because it's it's ice. We have a lot of ice. Like this is gonna be easier to deal with. Oh my god! What the frick was that noise about? If I have to change it later, I can change it later. But for now, this seems to be the best idea. You're going nice and fast and setting everything up. Power line is already on the side. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's fine. Yeah, two bots is definitely the way to go. Go, we have power to you too. Going around setting up all the power. I like this whole perspective of things too and how it's all changed. Okay, so now I actually have resources here. Did they take it from here then? I hope so. Power shortage of my oh yeah 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 yeah. I'm gonna have to I already knew this solar panel. It's two and two. How much are we sitting at right now? You are t you're gonna take it out of here, right? I think we're already full up on here.
What? Did I not? Oh no, I didn't even send it over here. Well, that's fine. Right? I hope. No, we are out of ice. Oh no. Um, we're just gonna have to demolish this one for right now. Let's go to normal speed for a second. So, the way that I feel like I'm gonna have to do this one is we're gonna have to actually connect this up via conveyor belt. No, if I... Well, I mean, that'll be fine. Because this one's gonna go this direction. Right? I lied. I think fast speed is just the way... It's just the way to go here. This power does travel through this. Right? Okay, so yeah, now this is producing ice. Good, good, good. Uh, because I'm here... How much? It does take ice for storage. Ooh, this could be a problem then. You gonna take it off the belt? Uh oh. Uh oh. I don't know how to do this. I may have made a mistake. Hmm. Hmm. Do I have to put the stuff in here for it to even count? I, I don't I don't know. I yeah, did too many power cables and other games like I don't know what to do. <laughs> oh crap. I mean I could have literally put one right here. Uh therein lies the problem. So if I demolish you, what do I get? I don't honestly know. Okay, well can I somehow take this off of here? I mean, I guess I could potentially take the conveyor and stick it into here. Don't necessarily want to do that, but we're going to do that for right now. Oh, I can't put conveyors on lava. Makes sense. I guess for now, this is just what we're doing. Okay, I need to destroy this. Unfortunately... Give me you two, create one more conveyor belt right here. Can you, can you guys do this? What's your problem? Cancel current boss test? No. What? This is, okay, so what's the point of storage if it doesn't actually work? I, I don't I don't understand the logic here. I really don't understand the logic here. Can you actually build these things? Oh, I see you're using that right now. Then why will you not build this one? You guys, please go work on this one. Why are you not building this? I don't understand. Conveyor belt, right there. What? What is the deal? Okay, this should be perfectly fine. And they aren't building it. Whatever reason. Okay, so we have a bunch more stone in here. Just, again, perfectly fine. But they are not doing this and it's driving me nuts. I don't know what to do here. Okay. I, I don't know why they wouldn't build it, but now they're doing it and everything's fine, so I guess we're good. Quite sure what was happening. I think maybe because this thing was still turned on. Go get all this stuff off here. Right. Just make it disappear. Okay. Alright. So everything's fine. Now we can actually make sure that we have enough power by building a couple more of these. You and you. 
Okay, can I literally just slap a storage in the middle of this? There we go. You guys go build that. I, I want to make sure we have a storage for all this. But I now need to figure out, like, the factory and everything else in that nature. Uh, so... Smelter. Let's slap that up right. I don't even know if I want to do this. This is the problem, is I don't know the silicone. I guess we'll put that there. I know I need one for iron, so we'll put this here. No, I need one for stone as well, so I'll put this here. And uh, I'm gonna remove you, and I'm gonna remove you. Eventually I'll remove all this too, because I won't have to have the ice connected up. But for now, there's a power shortage. You, you mean I do need to have more of this then? Iron ore. Can you not go get the iron ore from here? I swear to God, this game's driving me nuts right now on some of these things. Like, what is the point of this? Did you do it? Okay. Why is this second robot not doing anything? What are you doing over here? You, go help. Oh, because only one can build at a time. All right, we'll give you another solar panel since you're saying the power is not good. Power line right there. Can you do something, robot? I don't know what is wrong with my dumb robots. Yes. Okay, go take care of all this. Oh my god. Here we go. Everything's fine here. Power shortage of mine. Yeah, there's always a power shortage. Because we need more of these, and that's why I'm trying to work on this. How are you looking at? How are you looking right now? Robot? Robot. Robot. What are you doing? Okay, I see they are both moving. There's the last iron ore. Okay, so we need to go here, we need to go here, and this is silicone smelting, so we do this, I guess. Then I can put another storage up there. Okay, our shortage of- Oh my god! Wait, the sun is moving! Oh, it just hit me, I was like, wait a second. The sun is not in the same place that it was before. That's not great. So this is actually something I'm going to have to do. Alright. This is going to make things more interesting. I didn't realize the sun was rotating around this thing. I mean, I guess putting it like this would actually be a better option than putting that there. Is the robot actually helping? Okay, yeah, they're both doing stuff. All right, well, we're gonna go fast because I just can't. I can't. I can't. Like these kinds of, kinds of games, colony games, and stuff like that. I have a hard time playing on slow mode. We're gonna hit a point where we're not gonna have any power though. Sunlight is at seventy percent. Sunlight is at six percent. So yeah, we're really not getting a lot of power from this. But if I put it up on all sides, then it should at least give us more power for at least a little while. Okay, there you go. Is that giving us more power then? I hope so. Yeah, we're only down. Okay, all the power sort of shortages are gone. All right, good, good, good. So you two, after you're done with this, let me up another storage right here. Kind of think maybe building power would not be. Power on like different place. Right here maybe. I don't know. I'm trying to think of like a close place that I can put that that I can connect up. I guess putting some right here wouldn't be a bad idea. The distance it is. 
That should give me all directions besides couple. Those. I'm trying to connect everything via these two because I don't want to have to like deal with the nonsense that comes with that. Bots are already quite busy. I don't care. Make it sound like I care if the bots are busy. They're fine. They can do their work. They're on fast speed. As long as the robots are actually doing something, it's okay. Oh my god, this is crazy. Oh, I guess it would have made more sense to come over and do it here, but hey, whatever. It's fine. Um... It's like, are you guys even doing anything right now? Yeah, I guess they are. They're building stuff. Okay, sunlight of 22, so that's not great. Sunlight of 68. But it is going to start going up as time moves on. Just need to make sure, yeah, see, we're having power shortages in mind because everything's changing again. I mean, I guess maybe power lines to here would be a better idea than the power lines all the way over. Don't, I don't know. I mean, it's only like one thing, and as soon as they start getting over here, it should be nice and fast. Where are we sitting at? Okay, we got a ton of that in here. Um, smelter. Well, make me up this. Because I put all these smelters up, that's the big problem. I had to put all these smelters up. If the power wasn't such a pain in the butt, it wouldn't be so bad. Okay, but I'm sitting here at a lot of water, a lot of ice, so we should be fine on this being built. It's just a matter of waiting for them to do what they're supposed to. There we go. Is power changed now? Yeah, it's up to 32% on this. 66. God, your freaking power shortages! I was wondering if it'd be better to put things up in a different place. These days they're going, they're getting closer and closer, so I don't have to go as far. I like I like this whole 3D perspective. Dyson Sphere is like kind of, it's one of the reasons I think I like Dyson Sphere is because there was such a change, but you actually played as an actual little robot in that one. You didn't have this full control, but you still could fly around the entire planet. One of the things I always thought was really cool about it. So we're still, still, still dealing with the power shortage. This is insane. Guess the smelters just take that much power? Give me you two. Accumulator, energy storage. Okay, well, this seems like a thing that should be... What, what does it take to make? One silicone, two iron, two rope. No real good place to put this, then. Uh... Put two of those here, I guess. Are you waiting for? What? I don't. What are you talking about? What am I missing? Oh, uh, glass? Excuse me? Two iron. Okay, well, you know what? Then cancel these little robots' plans, right? I thought I was good, but I'm not. I need. Uh, not, not refinery. Wait, refinery. I think liquid materials? Well, I don't even have liquid. Smelter. Factory. Okay, so apparently I made glass in here. I was not expecting that. Uh, yes. Would you shut your face and stop yelling at me? Oh my god. That's obnoxious. So we're just gonna build more power. I'll literally just build it over here next to the actual already set up power lines. 
If you wanted to go as far, it's fine. And I need to put stone in here too. I'm wondering if maybe it wouldn't be a bad idea to, because there's only so much I can do here. Select you for carbon creation. These two. After you're done with that. Storage. This is what I've been trying to find the whole time. Now that you have all the basic resources, it's time to advance production. Start stealing glass. Okay. Your bots are quite busy already. I don't care. You make it sound like I care if my bots are busy. It'll work. They're robots. They're fine. I mean, is there a power... Power requirements are awful. It's still not enough power with all this stuff. That's crazy. But no matter what, I still I still need to build more. I mean, I, I assume it's got to be because of this constant changing of direction that it's on. There we go. <laughs> Cover all the bases right there. See, I only got 10 stone left in here. I kind of want to move everything up here, though. So if I were to say... Take you two. Iron construction material. Oh yeah, because you're still waiting on that. Oh, did I not? No, we're just running out of power. Okay, so conveyor belt. Oh, your bots are incredibly busy. I understand. But again, I don't really care. such a weird way to have to do this. I like it, but... Okay, so we can come up here. No, wait. That was pointless. I don't need this one. Launch this. Uh, you and you. The little badurm that keeps happening is, is driving me a little nuts. Okay, let's send you in there. You go that way. This way. Yes. Okay, so it can go two different directions. Looks like if I click on this side, yeah. Always seems to point the direction I want. Oh, I did the wrong way. Oh my god, there we go. Alright, alright. So I can take some of this out of here. It's not producing very fast. Actually, you know what? I lied. Let's turn that off for a minute. You know what I can do? Screw this. I'm just gonna build one specifically for this, I guess. I don't know what else I'm supposed to do here. And we got this right here. I actually have this right here. We're gonna remove you completely. We're going to completely shift you around, you and you. Now just make me another mine, which unfortunately is gonna take a lot more power, but whatever. Bring that thing there. I can connect this thing up if I need to put some iron in there, which for now, you know what? I think I'm gonna. Okay, so that just this just makes it so they cross over. Uh, oh, so they can combine into one. Hey, you guys are going to town, so that's fine. Just... Hmm. <laughs> hmm. What would be the best way to do this? So you're making carbon. I actually want some reserves now, because I want them to be able to go into here. What I'm thinking is... Best things to maybe do would be to grab these guys. Set up another mine, literally like, not like right here. There we go. So it'll put all the stones straight into there. I don't have to worry about it. 
big problem I feel is that's gonna come up is I'm gonna need a lot of fuel, or a lot of power. Which, I mean, once it rotates back to here and all this stuff starts getting sunlight, it'll be nice, but right now we have 0% sunlight. That's why I've added these things all over the place. Yeah, and now you're just telling me we're missing glass there, which is fine. So that's both of you. As far as what's sitting in here right now, we're getting more stone. Uh, the ore, the, uh, the ore from here should be showing up here soon. Oh yeah, all that stuff is showing up right now, so that's great. Eventually I'll end up changing this around so it's not quite doing what it's doing right now, but for now, stocking up on reserves isn't a bad idea. What's your problem? Mine depleted. Mine depleted? What do you mean, mine depleted? There's no ice left? What? Okay, uh, demolish you, I guess. I didn't realize that it could deplete that quickly. Okay, so give me you two. 331, 336. There's this one right here, I guess. It's 402. And exactly how I expected this to go, but uh, you to you, to you. Here we go. Let's connect it all up. And there's literally no point for storage at this point, I guess. Uh, I'm gonna leave this here because I'm gonna eventually connect that up first, but I'm, I want this here first First and foremost that way all the power is connected. Oh wait all this power isn't connected is it? Maybe Okay, well anyways this silicone needs to be utilized the best way for me to utilize this take you we take you and Slap up one more mine over here they put it right here. What was the glass, the smelter, factory. It looks like two stone and two silicone. All right, so we do a conveyor belt to here, here, here. Factory right there. And when it's done, you say glass work, so we can start making glass. And give me both of you, and we're gonna add a storage. Right there. And of course, just like usual, which is what I was, I was kind of expecting, I'm also gonna need to add some solar panels. Okay, I can't put it there, because that. Here. I'll put them here, because that's gonna be what opens up next. Basically, this whole corner is what I'm thinking is solar panels. Power shortage. I understand there's a power shortage. There's always a power shortage. Too much freaking power is needed for everything. Okay, fast forward. Alright, so you're just waiting on carbon to be put in there. Then I need to make steel as well, so I'm gonna have to actually adjust this whole thing. Probably just remove this entirely. Oh my god, what is your problem? Holy crap, what did I do? The factory just added an insane amount of stuff? Like, what the frick, dude? I mean, I have a ton of resources in here, so I'm not really worried, but... Good god. The degree it just suddenly shot up to of, like, how many ish issues. Factory must just take an insane amount of power. I see, this is the one thing that I don't see and I can't quite. The power reserves are seven, five. Yeah, that's fine. Glass production. Or glass construction, I know. I already knew that. 23%, 94%. So this is definitely the place to go for power right now. I mean, I can add some more right here, I guess. So 
So, I, you know what? Screw it. I will. Why not? Solar panels. Add you here. Okay. This whole different perspective and how it rotates around, it's like, it, it definitely adds to this. I remember in, like, Dyson Spear, which I have, like, a whole playlist. I'll try to, like, put a link to that playlist down below so you guys can check that out. Because that, that's legit one of my favorite games I've ever played. And I still go back to all the time. Uh, that one, there was, there was one planet. I had an entire planet just completely circled with solar panels. So no matter where the sun was, it was always hitting some of the solar panels that I had. And it was amazing. Right, and I mean, once it rotates enough, it'll get this side too. So I'm not too worried. I think the one place that I may be missing is. I mean, we got a bunch here, and we got a bunch here. They're at zero percent, but these are at ninety-seven percent. Is this enough power? It's still not. A... How is this not enough power? I do not understand. Yeah, I'd say it should be perfectly fine. We have a lot of power now. When we add a couple more, I'll add a couple more. Like, I don't think there's a downside to it, necessarily. Okay, so we're sitting good on all this stuff. I am going to cancel this, however. And right here, I'm going to demolish. I want to keep this here. I want to send it up to here. So, I guess our best bet would be... Oh, this is going to take even more power. Uh, You and you. Did you do this, by the way? Have you been producing glass? Two rock, two silicone. Why is it going that way? No wonder it's not doing anything. It's producing, but it's producing the wrong direction. Alright, now we have battery banks that are... Maybe going to fill up. Oh my god. <laughs> Even with all this power, it's still not going up. Stored energy is zero. Alright, well, my idea that I'm going to need a bunch of solar panels is not wrong in any way. I need even more. It's crazy talk. Alright, build even more. Oh, it's at 4% now? Okay, so it's starting to move up to there. Still at 99% though. But if I'm gonna be adding another factory for steel, like I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna need that. All right, uh, it is factory. Okay, so no, I don't want that there. But I do, however, want. Bear belts. Right there. What? What are you doing here? Yeah, inwards here. When this factory's done, I want you to make me steel. Oh, what's the other one? Waste material? Waste plant? Why would I want that? Is this already full? Okay, that made a lot of glass really quick. What is your deal? Depleted mines. Where? You're depleted already? Dig a hole. What? That's not what I meant to do? Alright, well, um, uh, boo. Yeah, about that. <laughs> hey, you keep telling me the same thing, game. I understand. Okay, so I need to put this 431. Yeah, that's fine. You gotta just reconnect that all up again. Right. Wait, wait, what? What? Wait, what? Is there another one? Oh, you're depleted too? Right? 168. 4. 4. Okay, right there. Here, this thing up there, 
No output. Okay, so yeah, all I need to do then is I need to bring this up here. So give me you two. Bear about this stuff, right? No. There we go. All right. Good. Speed up things. Big things have you required to optimize your production lines and produce 10 steel per minute. You have to build more factories and make sure you're supplied with a continuous flow of resources and enough power. 7 out of 10. 8 out of 10. Oh, we were almost there because it was built up so much, I think. Actually, I have an idea. I know I could cheese the system. Watch this. You too. Make me a storage. Set you right here. The one it in here. I set the reserves in. Actually, I'll set the reserves to uh, 12. There we go. So it'll build up 12 in here. And then I can literally just take the reserves down to zero. And I'll just be like, boom, and we got a whole bunch of them. <laughs> All right. Then as far as this, I can connect this up to here, and it'll be fine. You and you... Because there isn't anything I can tell that tells me to put more in there. there go. Extend another glass up there. And we're doing a good amount of power. I like all the little flashy lights. Okay, so you're currently there. God, you want me to build even more? I don't even have that much iron. Like, what do you want about? I mean, as far as stone's concerned, holy crap. We got a lot of rock. We got a lot of ice. Iron ore. Iron. Glass. Zero of ten because I'm not letting any go through right now. Wait, do I already have twelve? There's eight in there. That's what I thought. Two, four, six, eight. Waiting on two more to be made up. I mean, I guess I could start sending more iron in there. You know what? We'll just do this, too. I don't need to keep any in here. I don't need to keep any in here. There's no way to, like, upgrade these, is there? I don't think so. Okay, so how many do we have right now? Ten in here? Twelve. All right, so we go reserve zero. Look at it go, look at it go. Wait, did you just really reset? Oh my god, what the frick game? That was stupid. Oh, that was so stupid, I can't believe it did that. <clears throat> it would have done it, but apparently there's a set timer on the minute mark. Oh, that was so lame. Oh god, I just realized how long I've been recording for. Alright, alright. I'm gonna leave this here for now. Let me know if you guys want to see more of this. I, I'm, this, I find this very entertaining. This is cool. Like this whole concept that we just got a big old space here to work with and we're just like building it on, on the asteroids and everything and i mean like i said there's different modes too we can try out and everything so yeah let me know if you guys want to see more uh, i'm gonna save and we're just gonna go badoop asdf there we go it's always my saves every time i swear to god i want to go to the menu so free game mission free game minor colonist round flat rock lava okay asteroid size medium large Complexity, rugged, round, undulating. <laughs> Sting, okay, ice amount, 30%, that's fine. Lava amount, 30%. Extra resources, plenty. I just want to see what this looks like if we have a large asteroid. Like, like what is the largest asteroid we can go to? Because campaign, I imagine, it's kind of starting on a relatively smaller size. Because they, you know, want you to learn as you're going through it. I want to see what a large asteroid looks like before I end this real quick. Okay, so a large asteroid is relatively large. I mean, it's still not as big as I was expecting. But yeah. All right. But yeah, I'm going to leave it here. Let me know if you want to see more. Thank you so much for watching. I'll leave a link below to the game below. Yeah. Bye-bye for now. <laughs>